an old bank vault is being converted into a magical Valentine's Day location. Guests can enjoy anything from snacks to stunning photo ops. Malik Wilson takes us inside to give us a preview. Where is this? <laughs> hey, Dana. So listen, uh, we're going to get to that. But listen, there's a few things to score your perfect match, whether that be on Instagram, slide in the DMs, on Facebook, Twitter, <laughs> or like the old-fashioned days, just shooting in person. You don't know until you shoot. So I am currently, once, <laughs> once you score your match, you need to come out to City Museum, where I'm currently at. I'm joined with Ashley, who is going to explain why you should come with your perfect date here to the City Museum this weekend. Thanks for joining us. Please explain. Thank you for having me. Um, yeah, so we're having our Tunnel of Love event this weekend, Saturday and Sunday. Uh, it's a family event, so you can bring the kids, you can bring the whole family. We have lots of crafts. Um, we have our beautiful tunnel that's lit up with these hearts. Nice. So perfect Instagram moment. Right. Yeah. Photo op to get and, the likes. Yes, and also <laughs> the perfect spot for a proposal and an engagement. Oh. Yeah, we have been named the number one place in St. Louis to have a first date. Nice. So if there's a place to find love, it's City Museum. The first last date. Yes. First la last first date. That's that that too. Both <laughs> things. Yep. We've been listed as both things. That's nice. And so how many years have you guys been doing this? Um, this is our second year. Second year, so, okay. Yeah, and yeah COVID last... unfortunately kind of took this out of gotcha. the equation for a little while, but it's back. Um, and we're really excited to be able to celebrate again. So we'll be doing cookie decorating. We'll be making these shrinky dinks that are really cool. Um, so get your craft on. Nice. Um, and we'll be having a little bit of a dance party. So something for everybody. Definitely. And Saturday is the dance party, correct? And that's for that's all correct. ages? Yes. Awesome. All ages. And you guys got pinatas. Oh my gosh, aren't these incredible? <laughs> So yeah, one of our artists made these giant pinatas and they'll be filled with candy and we have been encouraged to let adults try as well because they're enforced. So. Nice, nice. <laughs> well listen, um, you know, like you said, this is for everyone. And so um, how long will this be going on? Saturday, Sunday, Monday, or just Saturday? Just Saturday and Sunday. Okay. Um, so it's kind of a warm up to the Valentine's Day. Gotcha. So 10 to three on Saturday, 10 to five on Sunday. Um, but yeah, come on out and you know, let the kids burn off some of this energy from being cooped up in the house. For sure, <laughs> with the snow and everything. So yes. listen, fellas out there, anything like me this is not it's something to do come out come out this weekend there's no excuse you guys have something to do and i'm pretty sure that your your significant other would love coming out to this um you know it's uh part of the admission yeah um, so yep, it's included once with you the pay admission. your admission just come right in and um have fun so we're going to come back with some more great things that the city museum is doing um in a few minutes uh but stay tuned dana sounds good like i said there's no excuses right yeah <laughs> leave it to the city museum to have a tunnel of love i do love that tunnel it's a great uh back for a photo, like you said. Thanks so much, Malik. We'll see you a little bit later in the show. Earlier, we took you inside the City Museum to learn about the perfect Valentine's Day date idea. Malik is joining us again to share how the museum is using love, not only for entertainment, but to also benefit uh, the St. Louis Library, right? That is right, Dana. <gasps> like I oh, said, oh. you gotta slide into the DMs. There's a few days left, but... Like I said, we're at the City Museum. Once you all slide into the dams, get your favorite date, come out to the City Museum because they're not only giving you guys the perfect date, but they're also supporting the community and the St. Louis Library. So yeah. can you please talk about that? Yeah, when the St. Louis Library, um, the Central Library, when they went through a renovation, they gave us their library stacks um, and some other materials from the library. And we, our artists, uh, have carved these hearts out of them. So they're really special, um, one of a kind, and they're a little piece of history. For me. Oh, it's okay. That is cool. I shouldn't have touched them. I knew better. Here, but, no. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, they're they're a piece of history and they're a gift. Um, and we are they're charging fifty dollars, but five dollars of every single heart goes back to the central library. And that is amazing. And so um, I know that these are made uh, from something special. So can you talk about that? How are these made? Yeah. So the library glass is this one in particular. Okay. Um, so these were the stacks over at the museum, and our artists carved them very carefully. They have to wear like a full hazmat suit to do it. It's wow. really crazy. I think you have some some footage of it. Um, but then they get packaged up and. In this really cute packaging and oh this is just really going wrong today Molly and then <laughs> and then we will package them up and you can pick them up from us or we can ship them to your loved one and you have the perfect gift nice nice um, and so did you guys do this last year at all uh, we did do this last okay. year so this is our second year doing this and I think it'll be a tradition we have a lot of this material 
Um, and you know, we, we get materials donated to us or you know, or purchased all the time. Definitely, awesome. So you guys can uh, get all the information that you need. It's gonna be posted right there on your screen. Uh, come out and support the library. Um, you guys can check it out. Uh, like we I said, can, yeah, they can shop go to shopcitymuseum.com okay. and that way they can pick them up. And if you order them by Tuesday, you should still get them by Valentine's Day. Awesome. Sounds like a plan. Dana, like I said, everybody go out there, shoot your shot, <laughs> come out to the City Museum, and bring your date. It's, it's, it's the best of all worlds and it's supporting the community. So, why so Malik, our camera, it got kind of cut off when you were coming down the, ton, the slide. Um, was it fun? That oh, slide kind of, I always feel like I'm going to get stuck in it there. Was, it, <laughs> it was really fun. That was my first time, and um, I'm scared of heights, so I don't know if I'm <laughs> going to go back. But, you know, do it again. Do I it always again. have this to talk about. It's all cool. Uh, all, all right. right well, well how much time do we have? Uh, no. I don't know. Melissa, how much time do we have? Not enough time. Okay, put it on the gram. <laughs> all right, we'll be right back. Uh